hi guys welcome back uh, in this video I will show you how to write or how to put a border in a LaTeX document uh, there might be a case where you may need to put the border in your document so this tutorial video will help you to put the border we will start uh, with the first line backslash document class 12 point comma a4 paper uh, with type is article next line uh, we have to use package use package uh, a package name is called as tixi uh, in case if this is not installed uh, in your mctech while compiling it it asks you to install whether to install or not uh, you, you just click on install so next is use tixi library use tixi library uh, in a flower bracket calc this is required to calculate the border length uh, in the command so that's it these are the two packages we are using I mean one package and one uh, package library next is begin document end document so in between okay, backslash begin Tixie library and end Tixie library in between this begin and end Tixie library we have to put this line uh, between the square bracket remember remember picture comma overlay so this is required uh, to put the border in one position otherwise each and every time when you compile it border, uh, border will go here and here and there okay so after this backslash draw in a square bracket this is to this is the line width of the border line width is equal to say I will give one point later on we'll change this and we'll see what what happens a space it's a normal bracket and in between dollar symbol and one more normal bracket the current page dot northwest so at this northwest is this portion so we can change this and this so here we have to give the dimension plus so 1 inch comma minus 0 0.5 inch x axis and y axis so and after this so we have to put a rectangle rectangle and this pattern repeats I mean this command will repeat here control B now here current page instead of northwest now the other end here this end it is southeast southeast uh, x axis is actually it has to go to left minus 0 0.5 inch and y axis is 1 inch and after this I have to put one semicolon ok this is it we will compile and build it ok we have error so error is saying that 
Dixie Library Undefined I'm sorry this is not Dixie Library this is Dixie Picture Dixie Picture and here end Dixie Picture ok we will see now yes fine so now if you have seen this when you run it for the first time it won't stay exactly at the center so you have to write one, I mean you have to compile it one more time fine now this is how we put border and uh, if you want to put any text inside the border you can just type anything so that will come and sit inside the border okay fine uh, now instead of if you want to make vary this border line width you just uh, give this number so I mean change this number line width number so when I put two point border width will nice and if you want to change this x axis in the northwest direction x axis in the northwest direction uh, I'll give instead of one here in the northwest direction I'll give two so this comes to right again okay. so similarly if you want to put this down you change this to instead of minus 5 I'll put minus 1 Okay, again, I mean, in the bottom for x axis for, uh, to change this to the left and right, you have to change the number here. So, here we have minus, I have put minus 0.5. If I give minus 1, so this will come this this line to comes to the left. Okay and instead of 1 if I give 2 ok this this will go up usually border we put border to the title page or any certificate page uh, in that case we do we usually don't uh, we usually won't be having this page number if you don't want that page number so you can I think this is here this page this page style this page style is Okay, we won't get to see the page number. Yeah, thank you.